In today's show, we're going to be taking a look at some of the most amazing solutions for providing water in the most inhospitable and arid conditions. Join us as we explore different awesome innovations that can create flowing water in places where they only receive less than 10 inches of rainfall per year. Without water, humans can only survive for around three days, so for the people who live in these conditions, they have to get creative. And you won't believe some of these incredible desert water technology innovations that we're going to take a look at in this video. From some ingenious ancient methods that are still being used today, to the latest in modern innovations. This is especially important since as we have seen year after year, we are depleting our groundwater reserves across the world. Water harvesting techniques can help us to replenish this valuable resource. Otherwise, if we keep constantly draining the water from the aquifers, the water table can dry up, causing a water crisis. As we already know, dams and reservoirs are proving to be unsustainable and uncertain, with water levels dropping even further year after year, not to mention the ecological damage that these structures cause for the watershed downstream. Since water harvesting is the solution to these problems, we are going to highlight the top 5 water harvesting methods that have been proven to work. So make sure to stick around to the end of the video to see which technique has made the number one spot and feel free to comment which method is your favorite. With that being said, let's dive in. At number five, we have check dams, also known as rock dams. Check dams have been scientifically proven to help slow the flow of water and even increase the amount of water available, which is absolutely amazing. Unlike modern dams, Check dams work in harmony with nature, since the system replicates what beavers create in the wild. This is why multiple rewilding programs for beavers have been taking place to restore the natural environment and watershed by allowing beavers to do what they do best, building dams. But when there are no beavers available, check dams can be a solution, since check dams are similar to beaver dams and do not entirely block water downstream, but they can still help with flood prevention. Check dams work by capturing the sediment as water passes through, thus slowing the flow of water and increasing the amount of water in the surrounding area. Without the check dams, the water flows away downstream and eventually out to sea, which is a huge loss of a valuable resource in dry lands. So this is why building check dams is especially useful in mountainous or hilly areas. Check dams also help to increase vegetation since nutrient-rich sediment is captured by the rocks, which allow for grasses or even trees to grow. Crops can even be planted here. This method has been proven to work in drylands across the world, but of course, it has to rain occasionally. One example where this system has been used successfully is at Cuenca Los Ojos Ranch in Arizona, USA, where a couple restored degraded grassland with over 40,000 check dams. As you can see, the results are truly incredible. Another example is in Saudi Arabia at the Al Badr project, which has helped once nomadic goat herders to restore degraded land and diversify their crops. At number four is atmospheric water generator machines, which have actually been inspired by ancient irrigation systems. These incredible new innovative inventions have been emerging for environments where there's very little to no rainfall whatsoever. There are a few different models on the market that are specifically designed to provide safe and clean drinking water only. These machines would not produce enough water for irrigating farmland, and they do require electricity to be powered, often by solar panels, as to utilize the abundant energy source within dry lands and deserts, which of course is the sun. One of the most advanced atmospheric water generating machines is Cumulus One. The device is a smart machine, offering options of mobile control through its dashboard and app, as well as functionalities that ensure water is delivered in a sustainable and economic way. Technically, the atmospheric water generator is designed to produce water from thin air, also known as ambient air. It sucks in the air and dusts it, then dehumidifies it by lowering its temperature to the dew point to create condensation. The water is condensed in the machine, then passes through four filters to remove impurities. Each unit can produce a capacity of 20 to 30 litres per day. One of these machines has already been installed in a school. 
Just as water security is so essential for our everyday lives, we also need a safe internet connection to get through the day. Just as drinking water is made safe by treating it to kill bacteria, your internet connection can be secured with private internet access. The world's most transparent VPN provider with over 30 million downloads. They never record or store user data their no-logs policy has been proven multiple times in court and recently by an independent audit. Private internet access hides your IP address and encrypts your internet connection. This way, it shields your digital lives from the eyes of internet service providers, network administrators and government censors. While helping safeguard your online privacy, Private Internet Access VPN software also blocks ads, trackers, and malicious websites. Private Internet Access has servers in 84 countries worldwide and in each and every state in the USA, so you can access more content than ever before anywhere in the world. Furthermore, you can use one Private Internet Access subscription to protect up to 10 devices at the same time. Most other VPNs support fewer connections so you get a lot more bang for your buck when you choose private internet access. What's more, they're offering an 83% discount if you purchase using our link. That's just $2.03 a month, and they're also offering an extra four months completely free. And signing up is risk-free. There's a 30-day money-back guarantee and 24-7 customer service support. So go ahead and click the link in the pinned comment or in the description to access your offer today. And number three is Bioswales, which is a nature-based technology utilizing the power of plants to hold water and filter it slowly whilst cleaning and purifying grey water. Bioswales are particularly useful in gardens, parks and even roadsides. They help capture surface water runoff instead of letting fresh water flow away into the drains or out to sea. In many cities today, trees and gardens are watered with municipal water, which has already been treated which you can imagine can be problematic for desert cities. And not only is treated water harmful to plants, but it's also expensive and wasteful when plants can easily be irrigated with rainwater. Bioswales can hold up in drought conditions when planted with native drought-hardy plants, thus reducing the need to water the swales and save valuable water. The bioswale system also helps to replenish the water table and improve water quality, since water is filtered through the plant and the root system. Bioswales have been installed in desert cities like Tucson, Arizona, but they have also been adapted for very rainy climates that are prone to flooding, such as in New York City, where they have now been extensively installed. There they have successfully helped with storm water overflow to help stop polluted water flooding the streets, subways and even people's homes. At number two, we have fog nets. This has by far become one of the most popular modern innovations when it comes to providing clean drinking water in areas where there's little rainfall available. But there is, however, an abundance of fog. Fog nets have been around now for a few decades, but the technology is being constantly upgraded and improved. The nets work by allowing for fog to flow through them, and the net is able to capture water droplets within the fog. The droplets flow down to the net and into the gutter, which allows the water to flow into containers, which can be taken away or piped off to allow people in remote villages to access an almost unlimited supply of water as long as the foggy weather permits. One of the oldest fog net installations is in the Atacama Desert in Chile, which was created in 1950. Over the decades, different versions of fog nets have been installed. For example, there's a system on the island of Gran Canaria, which is just off the coast of Africa, there's also another system in Morocco, just on the edge of the Sahara Desert. Both of these places have been subject to desertification and drier climates, which has helped remote villages to become more water secure. The only reason this invention has not hit the number one spot is due to the use of plastic fabric, which is known to degrade over time. And we know, microplastics are polluting the environment. However, the German company called Rasche Stiftung has a latest fognet innovation design, which has gone through vigorous testing to make sure the plastic is ultra strong and windproof up to 120 km per hour. The material itself has also been tested for being food safe, even after 10 years of use. And the number one spot goes to the Demi Loon, also known as Boons or Zyholes. 
This technique has made the number one spot for being cheap, simple and effective. It's an ancient technique that has been revived by a man named Yakubo Sawadogo. He is also known as the man who stopped the desert. Yakubo managed to restore hundreds of thousands of hectares in his homeland Niger, which is on the shoreline of the Sahara Desert. He did this by digging hundreds and thousands of zai pits. This amazing restoration technique caught on with many farmers because it managed to stop the Sahara Desert sands from expanding and has even been able to reverse the desert. By digging zai holes in a semicircular shape, water is captured and held within the pits, which can be filled with fertilizer and trees and shrubs, and even crops can be planted within the pits. This technique has helped thousands of people to become more food secure and avoid famine in one of the harshest environments on Earth. We have a video on the full story, so make sure to check it out here. And if you wish to learn more about these techniques, we have in-depth videos about each one. You can check the links in the video description or in the pinned comment. Thanks for watching. Until next time.